Hi, I'm Jack Crutchfield. Welcome to Obscurely Famous Graves, and boy, do I have one for you today. His name is Lieutenant Lewis Bennett, Jr., and he was from Weston, West Virginia, and he was the only World War I flying ace that the state had. He was born to a wealthy family. Uh, he was in his senior year at Yale when he dropped out of school in 1917 to form the West Virginia Flying Corps. And the United States Army wasn't interested in it, so he couldn't wait. And he went to Canada and joined the British Royal Air Force. Now, this is the part that's kind of mind-boggling. He became an aviator, and with only 41 hours flying time in his career, he shot down nine German balloons and three enemy aircraft. And here's the wild part. His career lasted 10 days, and he was shot down and killed. He didn't get any medals. His mother, who was very wealthy, dedicated the rest of her life to putting up statues, monuments. Uh, there's a window at Westminster Abbey. Um, his body was actually buried with full military honors by the Germans in Wavrin, France. I hope I got that right. And again, the intrigue. Uh, France was not in the habit of releasing bodies, so his mother secretly had it spirited out of France and brought back to Weston, where she built a huge statue called the Aviator. It's seven and a half feet tall, and it's still on display at the Lindsley School in Wheeling. Now, the irony of him not getting any medals, and this just blows my mind. There was actually a deserter from Canada with the same name, whose serial number was one digit apart, and the British thought that was him, that he had deserted in Canada. But there were clearly two Lewis Bennett Juniors because one of them, the deserter, uh, registered for the American draft. He was living in Detroit on the same day that our Lewis Bennett did. So it was a case of mistaken identity. That's why he didn't get any medals. And he did not tell his mother that. They simply said his service record didn't warrant it. Lewis Bennett Jr., West Virginia's only World War I flying ace, lost to history. He's buried in the Macpela Cemetery in Weston, West Virginia, and I'm not sure of that pronunciation. And as I always urge, please do your own research on this. Lieutenant Lewis Bennett, Jr., truly obscurely famous.